that that line right there, that's a that's confidence right there. That's confidence line. To me, my appearance is the right answer, dude. Hey guys, it's Tom here. Welcome back to the channel. It's day six day, and we're gonna finish off the Remember Us Youth Part Two album. So we got two songs left from that. We got So Cool, which is this one, and then we've got Marathon. And we'll have one other video for the day as well, also day six related. But as before, we no longer use the Young We whatever whatever channel for the lyric vids. We use iWe now because I listened. So this is so cool. Let's go. What am I listening to right now? I, that it's obviously some sort of build right here, right? But like. Definitely something I haven't heard yet from day six. Ooh. In case base. Okay, Bob. Okay, Bob. You look good, kid. These vocals, like these, they're they're all a little bit more airy sided vocals, and this this like nasty like slash drum beat that that Dolan's doing in the back, like this in the bass, like this is. I'm gonna make a dumb pun, but this is so cool musically. Yeah, dude. Like, it just sounds good. Ooh, the guitars, the guitar. I mean, the vocals are always there. The vocals are always there, but the guitars. Dude, these guitars are so good. These guitars are so good. How is he so cool? Look, look. I don't know what to do with his popular. Are they talking about Dolun? <laughs> Let's go, rapper Young K. My body has its own rhythm to my. This song is just straight swag, man. I love it. this song is awesome, and I love Wampo's voice right here. Like it's so high. Dude, this song is a bop. I love the guitars here. The guitars are so good on this on this, this chorus, pre-chorus, chorus pre -chorus song. So cool, aren't it? Yeah, y'all are. So tired from everyone's attention. These dudes, man. So could this potentially be written? Oh, I thought it was. Like... Could this potentially, like, with these lines right here, like, I'm so tired from everyone's attention. I'm like some kind of celebrity. I don't know uh, how I can hide this charm. Because this also could this also theoretically be written from the position of. Sunjin and Jay, you know, and, and and like their feeling towards potential anxiety this at this point in the career, although they still had, I don't know how many more albums they had until they took their break. Um, but could this potentially be double sided meaning lyrics of them already kind of putting that out in, in, in feeling this? I don't know if they had any part in writing the song or not. I don't know if this is all Young K uh, and Young K just writing because he's lit, you know, you know, feeling himself, if you will. But. <laughs> It's, and it's, that's the thing I love about, about music and songs is like it theoretically could have that double meaning even if it wasn't written that way, right? Like, oh. approaching such obviously it's, it's about coming up to somebody and you know that you're so cool type situation, right? I stand before you in perfect shape. Hey, how you doing, baby? <laughs> That that line right there, that's a 
That's confidence right there. That's confidence line. To me, my appearance is the right answer. Dude. When you're feeling yourself, you're feeling yourself though, right? This drum beat though, it's, it's simple, but like, He's using, okay, so that's either digital hi-hats or he's using really big hi-hats, like 16s or 17s, and getting that real big, like, sound, that slosh sound out of them because they're just really big cymbals versus the traditional 14s or 13s, theoretically, depending on what style of music you play. Man. So Cool is awesome. I love the music. The guitars were great, especially coming into the pre-chorus chorus part. You know, like um, I'm not gonna do it too much. Um, but the lyrics were great as far as how they can theoretically have a double meaning when you look at certain parts of the of the song, right? Like I don't think all of it is meant to be seen as that double meaning of you know potentially facing the anxiety um, of of being an idol and then a celebrity essentially, but. I feel like most of the song is written from the standpoint of, of extreme confidence, uh, which is fine. Ain't nothing wrong with that, right? But I really like this one a lot. The music was great. Their vocals were great without like, like they, would, they didn't have any like crazy vocal runs, but they didn't need it in this one, nor they needed any time. But like the vocals were still really good, right? Shocker, right? Day six, good vocals. Who would have thought? But. Uh, anyways, uh, let me know what you guys thought about this one. I thought this one was was awesome, um, as I do with fucking every day six song at the end of the day. Let's be real. But thanks for sticking around to the end. Cheers to you guys, and we'll see y'all in the next one.